Hello. I'm going to run through how to quickly build a model in Voxel using pretty much one finger. Here's Voxel, and this is a, the model we're going to build. It's already been done. It's kind of like those cooking shows. Here, I'm going to start opening up the settings, make a new file, start a new file, and we'll call this FLWR. Okay, start with a blank space. I'm going to pick a color for my stem. Tap in space and you get a block. If you tap a face of that block, you can add to the face. If you tap a block that's not selected, then it becomes selected. If you tap and drag the selected block, you can twist the camera. You can turn the camera by using two fingers, like this, but it's a lot easier when you're building usually just to use one finger. If I slide on the screen anywhere except the selected block, then I move the camera. So I'm going to build upward. Then, uh, I keep dropping the uh, phone. Okay, pick a color for the flower base. And here I'm just adding blocks by selecting blocks and then tapping to add. Okay, for my second color, I'm going to fill in on these corners. Like that. And then I have sort of a checkerboard pattern. All right, and then I want to go back to my original color, so I'm going to select it, then hit the palette and say pick color. Oh, actually, I guess I didn't need to select it first. Okay, so now I've got the old color. Notice the selected block doesn't, it appears lighter than the current color. That's just to show you that it's selected, but once it's unselected, then you'll see it as its true color. Okay, now I've got the uh, base of the flower there. I can uh, use two fingers to pinch, scale up or down, and like I said before, you can slide in one direction to rotate uh, like that. Okay, so uh, now I just got to put up, put on the uh, the next level. Oh, I think I forgot, forgot these blocks, like that. All right, and now we're just going to build upwards, like that. Oops, made a mistake. So I hit the U button, undo it. Oop, I did it again. Let me get a better access to that cube. Oh. Okay. And that's it. I think that's the flower. The colors are a little bit different. Okay. If you're still looking, there are a couple of other little things I'd like to point out. If you'll bear with me a minute. Let's say I, I want to put a box. Um, this, is, this is in the file this under tips and tricks. Something like that. Say I want to put a box on the corner there between those two but up a level. Uh, I could do it by tapping here and then adding this box and then deleting the one below by tapping on the little plus, little uh, minus plus thing there. So I'll put minus like that. But uh, that's a lot of work to do that. Instead, I could turn on the grid and then tap directly in space where I want that to go. So you can use the grid to uh, place objects in space that may not be directly connected to a block. Just useful to know.